morning, you guys. It is currently, I think, 10.36 right now, almost 10.40. Welcome back to my channel, Life with GSW. Make sure you guys subscribe to my channel. And today is the wedding planning series, episode two. You guys, and for today, we are going to be looking at venues. So we have two venues we're gonna look at. And of course, I'm gonna show you all the different venues. And at the end of the video, video, I want you guys to comment down below number one or two for which venue you guys might like, okay? So my mom and my grandma should be here in a few minutes, but I forgot to mention, if you haven't already, follow me on Instagram at Gaia Strength. And I also want to say thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you guys so much for running my first wedding series episode, like up to over 100 views. I'm so excited and happy that you guys loved it. And this journey, it's just making it much more exciting than it already is. So you guys, I'm going to see you guys in the car. I'm a little bit rushy because I've been running errands all morning this morning since like seven o'clock a.m. this morning. So I'll see you guys in the car. Bye. You guys, I totally forgot to show you what's the outfit for today. So this right here, it actually says bad, but this is really a dress and I just turned it into a shirt. And then here are my shorts here and my shoes for the day and my bag. Let's go. Okay, you guys, so we're here at the venue, and this is our first time. We've always seen this venue outside of this area when we would drive past it and everything, but actually being inside gives it a real feeling. It has the garden-like feel that I like and everything. Oh, example I gave you guys of the uh, so, pavilion or something like that. The area that was the example I showed you guys when we first talked in episode one about what the pavilion would look like. Wow, it was moved in 2001. This house yeah. was moved in 2001. We had a lot of, you know, a lot of uh, restoration. Wilma came through. So pretty. It could it'd be however you want it. Because I was thinking, however I come down the steps, I want it, everyone needs to see the bride. We yeah. Because this gives us a more open space than in there for people sitting. Right. I could see it more here. <laughs> I do like the idea of coming around. Yeah, I do too. Um, yeah. Is there Again, a way for the us to cover that? The be though? moved and shifted. Um, oh, this is so cute. Oh, yeah, this is very intimate. Sweet. Very intimate. In the closet when your day comes, okay. so that yours is the only bride and dress there is. Yeah. Um, so we put less wear and tear on mm -hmm. type of changes. Mm -hmm. Oh, God. Because every mm -hmm. man. Mm -hmm. <laughs> now, the men, they don't have a power mm -hmm. Okay, you guys. So we have finished the first wedding venue tour. So, if you have a sneeze, I do. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, um, mother, what do what were your main three things that spoke out to you? Like, what the what's your favorite parts of the venue? Like, three things. The garden feel that you wanted. Garden feel. The rustic barn look that's true that you wanted uh -huh. and the opportunity to create the vision create. that you want gamzy homey feeling okay just the total package mm -hmm. of the back home georgia the furnishing, everything was uh -huh. just on point for me. What was the third? I would say the location mm. 
it's convenient for uh -huh. gardening. everybody. It is, yeah. Yeah. For me, I love the garden feel. It had all of the colors of what I wanted the floor arrangements to mainly be. Um, you know, which is green, white. Um, I love the garden feel. That was my favorite part. I love the openness to be able to create um, how we want to. And also, um, I did like, I love the house itself because it just gives home and family and that's the goal of the wedding itself is to have everyone there that is home to us. Mm -hmm. And it's a natural like feeling and also the location, like I'm saying, you know, mm -hmm. it's beneficial for everyone. Um, yeah, any cons? that we might have um the uh, cons for me is the vendor the tables the chair like that type of stuff um was just the only con but there's other places you know that are like that's not every place has um tables and chairs but i do think it would benefit if they did but i do get that the main price is for having that space mm -hmm. um mm -hmm. I would say really that's like the only little um, thing for me. It would just be more costly on our end providing all, you know, vendors. But I think, you know. The con I had was the fact that, you know, you got to bring in your tables. and. and yeah. Mom, what was your con? If you had any cons. Um, my con is. I can't give context be beyond what I see. Like, I can't... You can't visual. I can't make all of what you want... Makes it. ...happen. Yeah, you can't visualize I can't it. visualize. Yeah. I see... I know what you want. Uh -huh. But in sometimes a blank slate... It's very ...becomes hard. the... It be, yeah. It it's becomes hard, hard to... to create all of those moving pieces That's without true. having to incur yeah. a, an additional fee yeah. and they of really a didn't or something. have like we kept saying we wish we had wedding photos to go by yeah because yeah. that's one thing we didn't yeah like really i'm looking see, at the, looking you know? the flyer the only yeah the, the wedding yeah but you guys, so we are going to head into our the second venue and to see how that is like, and you know, be open minded. And since we already saw the first one, we could see what one you know provides, what the other doesn't, and which moment you know could make more sense. And we have time to choose who mm -hmm. is gonna be what. Mm -hmm. But yeah, so on to the second venue. You got it. Yeah, it yes. Okay. <laughs> Okay, we're going to see the ballroom first, just because there is. <laughs> <laughs> I think this is seeing it like this. So we get to one of the whole room, even of at course. the number? Yes. Look at the mall. Not fast. Mm -hmm. 72 inch rounds. That's her table. And it's in its room. It's spacey. It's just. Oh, yeah, you have to put that table over. So 10. Oh, yeah, we can make it. Yep, the middle. So, of course. Oh, you could. You could do it this way. Oh, my God. Wow. Then you can have more cocktails. Like they are doing. So cocktails are going to flow. Okay. Oh, it's not okay. Mommy, can I see it? Keep it rigid in here. Oh, yeah. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my So we say, here, 
pick up elsewhere than a bride your girl in a dress. And touch up. I love gloves. it, guy, yeah. yeah. Thank you. Most do that. Um, you know, not. We are finished, you guys. We are finished. This venue has really shook us the boat. <laughs> um, it gives Gorge. top tier. It just gives everything that we want. And, and more and, more and um, allows for the creativity to happen um, yeah I am happy <laughs> very happy mommy what do you have to say I'm gonna be broke mm -hmm. but it's a well brokenness <laughs> gonna it that it's gonna be for sure confessions too so we have finished on a scale one to ten <laughs> it's a ten for me it breaks it's a, a 10, 10 out of 10. scale for yeah, me yeah it's beyond 10. It, yeah because it was i mean one of the pros was that we get to have a golf cart. <laughs> yeah, that, that was a seller. You know, to go to one of the locations where we could take our pictures at. Um, I and like, it was very personable. I like uh, the all, all, all the inclusive. inclusive piece. Everything they offer for every need that you have, they can fulfill it every single one of them all the way down to the little details that you thought were going to be a big deal to the mm -hmm. fact that you're trying to incorporate uh, making sure you incorporate both cultures, um, both both cultures. because if you don't the know um, chef hold on, Mom. okay if you don't know um ethan is haitian so our families are coming together i'm american if no one knows and ethan is haitian so it's gonna be well Merging. And a mer yeah, a marriage of all of the cultures. So that's a big thing that the chef is even Haitian and right. and knows the main dishes that you're wanting. Right, and two that we don't have to worry about outside vendors going to trying right. to taste this, you know, taste the food and right. seeing if that works. It, no one is gonna have to work. Right, and, you and our the, side to you get the setup of how you want it with the yeah. It's, can't tell those details right, right, but right. you get that mm -hmm. yeah. as well um guys this was a very exciting day yeah. it was very exciting yeah. and um people are what get me in places whoever we are speaking to when we're going somewhere you know that rubs off on the place yeah mm -hmm. the, yes um their and customer I, service I, the customer service and then the pe you can tell people's heart, heart mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying so um, we're happy I'm happy stay yeah. tuned guys stay tuned Still, guys Ethan this, gets to come back and see it yes Ethan was going to come back he um, wasn't here today um, but I did send him pictures throughout and I'll be sending him more um, so Ethan shall come back definitely um, whenever we can do that but you guys mm -hmm. This is the end of the wedding series episode two of venue tours so you guys like i said in the beginning comment down below number one or two to pick which venue you like the most did you like one or did you like two yeah i want you guys to do that and also um put the hashtag year of when we're getting married because that, that's just going to be our hashtag lingo. Hashtag, you know, 2024 in the comments. Because that that's our, what do you call it? Our Your handle? I say, your that's ha our, I say the hashtag. My hashtag for them is T. T-E-A. T. -E -A, T. Who, who T. thinks they know what that is? Hashtag T. T -E know the T. T-E-A. If you think you know what that out. is, let us know. Put yeah. it in the comments. <laughs> T. Okay, so figure out what hashtag TEA is in the comments, whoever, you know. It's the T, honey, for 2024. Right. So, T. yeah, T's 2024. 
all right guys so that is the end thank you guys so much for watching and tuning in again and thank you so much for showing so much love on the first episode of the series getting us over 100 views thank you thank you thank you make sure you guys subscribe and follow me on instagram at gaia strength to also see more of the wedding journey on my instagram but we will see you guys in the next video Peace. bye